The first movement of the 39th symphony in E flat major takes an even more moderate tempo. One important orchestral solo is the recitative in the last movement of Beethoven's Ninth Symphony, which gives proof of the increasing demands made on orchestral bassists. Here, the basses anticipate the singing voice in their declamations. The most beautiful legato theme in our bassist life. Since Dragonetti, the power of the bow had increased. Hector Berlioz's works reflect this change. An example is seen in his Symphony Fantastique in the macabre March to the Scaffold. Mm -hmm. 
Dotted notes, an element which we encounter constantly in the entire Romantic period, from Beethoven and Weber all the way to Richard Strauss, are a means of highest drama in Schubert's great C major symphony. In Beethoven, the dotted notes appear as triplets, as a dance-like way of increasing the tension. Let me demonstrate again the proper way of playing dotted notes, never with the arm, only with the thumb. Fortunately, most great composers in history were themselves competent string players. Vivaldi, Bach, Haydn, Mozart, Beethoven, or Dvorak and Hindemith. Mozart, Beethoven, or Antonin Dvorak and Paul Hindemith. In their music, each phrase corresponds to the natural way of leading the bow. Things become more problematic with some composers, as for example Richard Strauss. This wonderful master of counterpoint drafted many of his works at the piano, therefore they are full of difficult passages for us bassists. Thank you. 
Often in Richard Strauss, the main difficulty that has to be practiced is the division of the bow. Let us take the main theme of Ein Heldenleben. Mussorgsky's Pictures at an Exhibition was first composed for the piano and later orchestrated by Ravel. The dispute between the rich and powerful Goldenberg and the poor lamenting Schmuile is illustrated in a scene that is composed in a truly pictorial manner. A theatrical dialogue presented by an expressive oriental sounding bass theme and a plaintive trumpet. Mussorgsky knew what he could express on the piano, and so we bassists have to provide with unconventional bow division a way in order to put the arabesque ornamentation of our solo into the context of a great melodic arc. Mm -hmm. 